guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, hi, my name is Maddie of Maddie's Crochet Corner. I own an online Etsy shop that has been open for about a week now, and I've had this YouTube channel for a few months, I think like three or four months now, and yes. Um, in today's video, I'm just going to be doing like another vlog, just like a day in the life kind of thing. Um, I do have a to-do list right here of what I'm hoping to be done today. So, um, yeah, let's go ahead and start the video and I'll show you what's on my to-do list for today. pattern because I still need to do that. Um, I did edit it a lot in the previous video which I'll leave in the description box but I did not do it enough. I didn't put the card of pictures on it which I needed to do and then work on my cubone which is probably going to be the first thing I do today. Um, film part of the video which is what I'm doing right now. Organize my yarn which is much needed because it's kind of just like in different places in my room right now so yeah and clean my room um which is probably gonna be really easy they're just like a whole bunch of like packages from the yarn i got the other day and just like a little bit of trash so that's it um water my plants because i haven't done that in a few days and they probably need water um let's see post five reels on each social media um, I think I've posted two so far on Instagram and TikTok and on my YouTube as well. Um, so three more. Um, work on writing a pattern. I don't know what I will be writing the pattern for. I'm still trying to figure that out. Um, but yes. If you guys have any idea of like any patterns you want me to make or like try to make then leave them in the comment and then i'll do my best to try and make them um then the next thing on my to-do list is a workout which i need to do i didn't do it yesterday um i don't know why but i did get lots of steps in and we went bowling last night which is really fun and i think i threw out my shoulder somehow i tweaked it but it's doing a lot better than it was yesterday and just saying in our match uh Bioless, I got second place, which is pretty good. I think my score is like 86. I think. Um, then the next thing is work on a new listing, which I'm still thinking about what I would post. I think I might do either my hanging plants or my frog that I showed in the previous video. Um, do literature, which is a subject in my school. Um, I'm definitely going to be doing that. It's just reading and then taking some quizzes. But I need to work on that and then work on changing my crossbody bag to a backpack. So the crossbody bag I'm talking about is a sunflower one. I took it with me last night to go bowling so I can crochet some strawberry keychains. So it's just this bag. It was my first ever crochet bag that I made. And it's really cute. But... I want to make it into a backpack because with these straps, I messed it up. So I made the straps too long the first time. And so I cut it and now it looks like really, really bad. So I'm just going to be cutting it off and um, yeah, just taking the straps and making them into a backpack strap. But yeah, I really love how this turned out. And if it turns out really good, then I definitely will be posting this not this bag but like other bags over on my etsy because that would be really cool that would be a huge opportunity for me that i would love to do but yeah sorry that my chair is like so squeaky i have no idea what is wrong with it it's just like every time i move it does it um but yeah um let's just go ahead and crochet yeah, let's go ahead and, and pop it into it.
so far is I made the cheeks, there's two of them, I made the other eye, the body, as well as one arm. I do have one more arm left to go, and then the tail, two legs, um, two feet, and back spine, the bone, and it looks like that is it until I have assembly. So I think I'm just going to stop it for today and probably work on it tonight. And if I am able to finish it tonight, then I'll go ahead and um, show you guys the final product. But I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I do have a busy day today. But yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and make some breakfast and then probably do some editing of my Etsy shop. And then we can get back to the to-do list. So let's go make some breakfast. Okay, I am upstairs now and I'm going to make some breakfast. I'll probably have some sausage, an egg, toast, and probably a banana if I feel like it. Also, look who just woke up. She did not want to get out of bed this morning. <laughs> yeah, you tired, baby? It's okay. I'll put you down. You, can... you have to eat breakfast. <laughs> She's like, Mom, why did you wake me up? Yeah, she's so tired right now. I don't know why. All she ever does is sleep. What do you want? You want to go down? Here you go. Breakfast. I'm just gonna have some Applegate chicken and maple sausage, probably two scrambled eggs, and then some keto white bread, which is my favorite brand. I love having that. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and make it. Just finished making breakfast and it looks like this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and edit my Etsy shop a bit while I'm eating and then get back to the to-do list. It's like waving the fork around. <laughs> okay. Now done eating. So the thing I'm gonna do on my to-do list now is organize all of my yarn and crochet stuff. I know I did some of it in my last video, which I'll be linking in the description box, like I said before. But I didn't organize my yarn. I just organized all of my stuffed animals. Stuffed animals. Like the plushies I made. But yeah, let me show you what we are working with currently. What my yarn area looks like. It's kind of a mess right now. I do not know how it got to this point. So I just have my little cart that I got here. And then I'm watching a video while I'm going to be doing this. And I do have more yarn everywhere. Like I have more in that Target bag right there. But... I'm gonna see if I can tackle this first and see what it'll look like. So, yes, let's go ahead and jump into that. So far, I put all of my acrylic yarn in here. It's also my uh, cotton and polyester yarn. So that it's all organized in there. And then I have all my extra ones, like leftovers of a skein of yarn in there. And I found these. I think I have more in a pile somewhere. I think I'm going to throw them away. Like, I don't need to keep them. But yeah, there's a lot of them. And I went ahead and put all of my, like, brunette velvet, brunette, just like any brunette blanket that I have in here, as well as my Perfect Chunky yarn and the black yarn that I use for my eyes sometimes, like this little mushroom dude has some, and some white for when I need it. Actually, I need to buy more white. But yeah, I have all of these, all of these. They're really nice colors. Um... And I have decided for my new listing, which I'll probably work on today, I'm going to make a giant dino. So, yeah, it's going to be this color. I'm just going to make a whole bunch of them because I need to get rid of that yarn so that way I can buy more yarn. <laughs> like regular colored yarn, not multicolor. But yeah. But yeah, all of my yarn is uh, done and organized. I just need to go ahead and clean my room do some literature, crocheting, and work out. It is currently like almost 11.20 right now. 
So I'm probably just going to go ahead, tidy up my room, crochet for a bit until probably like 12 or 12.30. And then 12.30 to 1, I'm going to go ahead and do a workout. And then from 1 on, I'll probably do some literature until like 4 or 5. And then I'll talk to you guys then. But I will give you an update once I'm done crocheting and stuff. And right before my workout. And then when I start literature. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead, tidy up my room, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so it is now currently almost 3.30. I didn't get as much done as I wanted to. I wasn't able to work out today because I did get sidetracked and I don't think I wanna be working out today, but I was really active today, so that helped. And I did tidy up my room a little bit and did make the school mainly until now. So yeah, now I'm just going to go ahead, crochet, and work on the Q-bone. I'm almost done with it. Uh, I can't wait to be done with it. Okay, let's get into that. Okay, I am now done crocheting all of the Q-bone. Um, I just have to assemble it, and I honestly don't feel like assembling it tonight. Yes, it is tonight, because I procrastinated finishing it. It's currently 6.40. <laughs> but yeah, this is all of the parts. There's like so many of them i cannot wait to be done with it the worst part is sewing and that is what i'm going to be doing tomorrow why did i do it like that i have no idea but um yeah i'm just gonna be crocheting that tomorrow and what i didn't show you um uh, before i started doing that is i crocheted this dinosaur a chunky one i will be posting this on my etsy um, I think the only thing I want to change is putting the eyes a little bit form forward so you can see them. Because you can't really see them when you're looking straight at it. Like, you can see it from the side and that's it. But it's super, super cute and I love it. It's so soft and squishy. There are already some people that want to buy it, like, in person. And then I also made this sunflower. Um, this is my own pattern and I love it so much. I did just put it on, like, a wooden skewer and wrap stuff around it. Um, I do want to put these on my Etsy, but the only thing I want to change is how I wrapped it because it's not really wrapped that well. Um, I won't be selling this one, I'll be keeping it because it was a prototype. And I do want to put the leaf down lower so people can actually see that. But yeah, so that's what um, my day mostly consists of is just crocheting, doing school, and tidying up my yarn. Um... But yeah, thank you so much for coming along with me in today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you have any other type video ideas that you want me to make, um, I'd love to hear them. Just leave a comment down below. But yeah, I will definitely be making more videos like this in the future. And in the description box, I will leave a link to my TikTok, my Pinterest, as well as my Instagram and my Etsy. I'll also be leaving a link down to the Cubone pattern and and to Alyssa G's um, YouTube. You may also know her as Lumi L Art. She also crochets and has an Instagram, but I'm just gonna be leaving a link to her YouTube on here. But yeah, this has been such an amazing day and I hope you guys enjoy this video and don't forget to go and watch my live. If I I'm able to post it, this video tonight. Go and watch my live tomorrow. So on Thursday, I think it's the 25th. The yeah, the 26th is so Thursday the 26th. I will be doing my live at 9 a.m. Hawaii time. I do not know what time it will be for you guys, but definitely please come and watch it. I would love to see and chat with you guys. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching today's video, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, yeah.